Lesson 7. If, else, if, else. To follow along with this lesson, you will need to create a new empty console project and add a new C++ file named main.cpp to it. If statements allow us to choose whether or not to evaluate a portion of code based on a condition. Here the if and the condition y is greater than or equal to x use a relational operator to define the conditions under which the code inside the braces is executed. With x equal to negative 2 and y equal to 3, the graph shows that the point is inside the truth region as the execution showed. On the other hand, if we set x equal to 1.5 and y equal to negative 2, then the point is outside the truth region as executing this somewhat unexciting piece of code shows. Often we will want to execute some code when a statement is true and some other code when a statement is false. To do this, we can add another if statement like this. Executing this code outputs y less than x. While this code works, there's a better way. We combine the if statement with an else. The code inside the braces after else is executed when the condition inside the if is false. So we can execute the code and we can get the same output as before. However, this solution is more elegant and less error prone. If and else work well for two alternative paths. However, we may want to have more than two different paths of execution. Looking at a number line, for example, we might want a different path of execution for x greater than 2, x less than or equal to negative 4, and x greater than negative 4 and less than or equal to 2. In this case, we can add an else if as another path of execution, like this. We can add as many else-if branches as we like. Going back to the case of two variables and using the regions y greater than or equal to x and y greater than or equal to negative x, we can break the plane into four regions via the logical operation AND. Here we have labeled the regions of the graph according to the conditions that each represents. The corresponding code to check these conditions looks like this. Notice that the conditions in the else-if portions only check one condition. This is because an else if means if this and not anything before it. In terms of our if statement conditions, the regions can be labeled like this. This concludes the lesson.